Uring. Now an update to a News 4 Jack's I-Team investigation. If you've been forced to pay an unusually high water bill at Three Seasons Mobile Home Park in the west side, there is now help. The city of Jacksonville's Office of Consumer Affairs wants you to file a formal complaint and is giving out a phone number for you to call. The city is responding to a series of I-Team reports on a disabled veteran who had to pay more than $2,200 for two months of water. Tark Miners joining us now with this new development. Tark. And Tom, the Three Seasons Mobile Home Park is owned by Moore Enterprises out of Irving, Texas. And locally, they also own the Americana and the Orange Park North Mobile Home Park. So if you've received a sky-high water bill, the number to call to file a complaint with the city of Jacksonville is 904-630-2489. An investigator with the city wants to find out if other tenants are experiencing similar issues. We also spoke with lawyers for Jacksonville Legal Aid who are familiar with similar allegations in the past at the Three Seasons Mobile Home Park. I feel like I've been dropped in the twilight zone. I mean, what could I possibly do with all this water that I don't have? I have no leaks. I've paid plumbers more than one to come out and verify that there are no leaks. That was Three Seasons Mobile Home Park tenant Kelly O'Neill on Wednesday after receiving yet another outrageously high water bill after paying more than $2,200 for water previously for the months of July and August. I'm being charged $1,734.88 for two cubic feet of water. O'Neill learned later that day that she only used 7.4 gallons of water that month from a meter reader who works for Three Seasons who added this. I after I read them, I send them to the managers, and, and when they, they put them in the system, and that's it. The system calculates everything else. That's all. That's all I know. News for Jax has heard from other Three Seasons tenants, both past and present, by email or on newsforjax.com, who say they, too, were forced to pay sky-high water bills, piquing the interest of city officials. A spokesperson for the Office of Consumer Affairs, however, says their office hasn't received any official complaints urging affected tenants to call this hotline at 904-630-2489. Jack's Legal Aid Division Chief Adam Thorison says he's also familiar with allegations at Three Seasons Mobile Home Park. Similar to what's going on now, what, what we saw and what uh, happened in our opinion was that the usage was um, extremely out of line with historically what that particular tenant, what that household had used. And as a lawyer, that, that's just something that's going to raise red flags. Thorison urges tenants confronting the situation to make sure they continue to pay the landlord and other obligations that you're not disputing. He also offers this advice for tenants in making a case against their landlord. I also think it's important to communicate with your landlord in writing. If you encounter this issue, uh, something that doesn't look right to you, you know, write them a letter. Uh, shoot them an email through your tenant portal, just something so you can document what's going on and, and look back at that later. So lawyers tell me when a tenant disputes their water bill, especially when it's thousands of dollars and out of the norm, it's customary for the landlord to investigate the source of the water consumption before charging the tenants. But that is not what happened here. Three Seasons Management threatened Kelly O'Neill with eviction if she didn't pay that $2,200 and only now after she received her second bill for more than $1,700, now they are agreeing to conduct their own independent investigation. If this has happened to you or someone you know at Three Seasons Mobile Home Park, Americana or Orange Park North Mobile Homes, you can find the number to that tip line on this story on newsforjax.com.